What's going on guys, Core Previant here with another Hell 2 video. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to pack Gunfire Reborn. It's really easy to hack. As you guys can see, I'm going to be showing you guys how to have very quick movement speed, very high jumping, and no reload on your guns and infinite ammo. Even though this gun has infinite ammo, and it gives you infinite ammo on every gun. But as you can see, I'm not having to reload. So this hack works really, really great. Um, especially for starting out and trying to get further in the game. Um, one thing to note is some of the stuff cannot be changed because it's server side. So don't expect if you're watching this video, you're gonna be able to edit your gold or edit your souls because you cannot do that or your talent. So um, that's all server side stuff. It's just something that cannot be edited. But again, I'll be showing you guys how to have unlimited ammo, um, no reload, fast movement speed, and very high jumping. So let's just jump right into it. The first thing you guys are going to do is open up your internet browser and you're going to, going to want to go to cheatengine.org and at the very top you're just going to click on download cheat engine as you see I already have down here at the very bottom. It only takes a second to download. Now one is, once it is done downloading you do not have to open it. I will put a link to everything also down below in the description so just check that out if you don't feel like uh, watching this whole thing and you just want to skim through it. So after you download Cheat Engine, just make sure it's on your computer. I recommend putting it on a removable thumb drive. Um, that's what I've done. And uh, that way you can take it out. That way you don't risk being banned on other games if you plan to use this beyond Gunfire Reborn. But you cannot get banned in Gunfire Reborn. Anyways, we're going to go ahead and go to the second part now. Is you're going to want to go to fearlessrevolution.com. And I have a link for this as well in the description below. And this is where you're going to download the actual... Uh, mod to inject into cheat engine so you're going to click the very top one if you're using windows you'll click the bottom one uh, if you were using mac so um, again just click the top one if you're a windows user after that's downloaded you go ahead and go to your downloads folder and you're going to see something like this in it as long as you have cheat engine installed already so all you got to do is double click that to open it And you're going to see this pop up. Once this does, you're just going to click the little computer up here that's highlighted and blinking at you. And the game has to be open at this point. So go ahead and open your game and get into a game um, to make it even easier. And as soon as you're in the game, go ahead and select the process and hit open. And hit yes. And now you can check mark any of this stuff that you want to use. Now, I will get into the weapon pointer, player pointer, um, and server pointer in my videos probably tomorrow or the day after. Um, because there's actually ways you can edit your weapon. You can edit the grenade launcher to give um, to where you can use one grenade and blow up the entire map. You can change the radius of the explosion and things like that. I'll get into that in a later video. As I said, right now I'm just going to skim through some of the basics. Um, all you're going to do is just check these on. Mine already are loaded in the background. That's why it's not letting me do it. But you'll just click them and you'll get a little check mark there. And you can go ahead and go back into your game after you do that. And you'll have the changes already there and running. That's all you have to do. It's really easy to use. Um, now, the one thing to remember is you can still die. And, you, you know, I'm, I've been playing with it for a little while now, and it's still very, very frequent that you'll die. This does not give you unlimited shield and does not give you unlimited health. Um, there are some things that are server side that I said that you cannot edit. So again, don't expect to edit your souls or your money. That's just things you cannot do. Um, but not having to reload and having unlimited ammo comes in extremely handy. So, again, I hope this video helped you. If it did, please subscribe and like it below. And uh, tune in to the next couple days to show you guys how to edit the guns even further. Thanks for watching. You're all going to die down here.